What's up, guys? It's me, T Belly. How's everybody doing today on YouTube? I hope you enjoyed this video. Let's get an introduction. Sega! Classic Sega. Um, right now, I'm gonna show you. I'm a, we're gonna have uh, some gameplay footage, handheld gameplay footage of Sonic Mania. And of course, that's for the Nintendo Switch because that's the only hybrid system that allows you to play handheld as well as, you know, at home on the console. So I already beat the game with Sonic and Tails. But what you can do is when you start a new game, you have the option of using Sonic, Tails, Knuckles, who has his own adventure. The levels are slightly different. Or you can go with classic Sonic and Tails, which is something I did. So let's get right into the gameplay. So the first thing you notice is the classic Green Hill Zone music to start the game. I mean, I think this is like the perfect way to start this game. It's a brand new, like a rebirth of Sonic the Hedgehog in 2D and it's something, you ju they just did it right. They did it perfectly. So you have special stages, which you see the, uh, the little star like circle thing going on when I hit the uh, checkpoints. But I'll get into that later in the game. I'm not a big fan of those stages. Um, they give you unlocks in the game. And you also have the uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles have has um, a different way to get Chaos Emeralds. You have to actually find these hidden big stars to enter the special special stages for um, Chaos Emeralds, which this game has its own also. So it gives you like a mixture of both. And here we go. I was just talking about the Chaos Emeralds stages. So check it out. It's nice. It's 3D. It's something cool. And what you have to do here is collect coins to keep your timer going and collect blue orbs so you can get your speed going and you want to catch this UFO. So I basically edited that out so you can see me just get the Chaos Emerald, which is one I already have. That's why you don't see a new one pop up. I already have that one. Well, I'm, I finished the game missing four Chaos Emeralds. <laughs> and uh, you, you need the, to get the real ending, you have to get the full thing. So wait, hold up. I just had to let that sink in. I love, and I mean I love me, some chemical plant zone background music, stage music, whatever you call it, it's awesome. And I took the uh, higher route. And Tails died somewhere back there. There he goes, coming back, finding Tails. That's one thing I'll say about this game. Tails is definitely, his AI has been definitely um, tweaked. It's much better than than regular because Tails is, is one tedious character. He dies for everything. And in this game, I noticed he's been very, very good. I mean, not very, very good, but he's been a much better partner. He actually helps me a lot, too. And I miss that little, uh, that little direction I wanted to go in. Oh, good way to go back. So as you see, the, the graphics are 16-bit Sega Genesis graphics, but there are times the graphics look a little bit better and I just want to show you just a little bit of gameplay footage nothing too crazy we will eventually get into some Sonic I mean sorry some Knuckles gameplay a little bit after I just want to finish this stage for you guys but I'm not going to do the whole stage we're going to edit out right here alright so there goes the the uh the um these stages whatever so as you see they took a book out of Sonic 3 and Sonic and Knuckles with these and um I already beat a lot of them, like a whole bunch, I don't know how many, so this is a more advanced level, which I, I couldn't finish, and I, I, I don't like these levels, but I'm able to deal with them better after playing them so many times, I actually like them a little bit, so I already beat the stage, boss, I didn't want to spoil it for you, here's the end, and we're going to get into some Knuckles gameplay from his story. It's a little different. See, as you see, they just finished doing something. So he's in the same world as Sonic and Tails, but he's in another area. So that's why his, uh, it makes sense. It, it's nice how they did it. They did the story, so it's not the exact same. He's somewhere different on the map, in the area, in the world, in Green Hill. And uh, here we go. His stages are very different. As you see already, it started very different. Based more off Knuckles gameplay, which... I love Knuckles. I really like Knuckles a lot. He's definitely my second favorite character in this series. As you see, very different. His gameplay is different. Um, and I'll give you guys a tip. In competitive mode, I challenge anybody. 
to Green Hill Zone. Just the first level. Green Hill Zone. Let's go head to head. You could take Sonic or Tails. Give me Knuckles and I'm going to school you. Because Knuckles, I'll tell you right now. There's certain parts. There's some parts of the game where some levels in competitive mode. He's going to smoke Sonic. Just because his ability to fly. He'll be able to take different routes. So it doesn't matter how fast you are with Sonic. He's going to get it. I just wanted to let that music play for you guys. I really enjoy the uh, mid-level boss uh, music. Well, not mid-level. Every every level has a boss. So at the end of the first act, you're going to fight a boss. And this is the one of the first level, which everybody has showed by now. So I have no problem showing you this one. And um, one remix thing that happens is after every act, the music changes slightly for the second act, which you're going to see right now when I finish this level now. You're going to see the music change just a bit. Hope you enjoy the video, guys. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. It's your guy, T-Belly. I'm signing off. Cheers.